Hey, but that new series though, you trying to talk though, okay. Hey, what's going on everybody of YouTube, this is Ken Andy Daily, and I'm starting this new series called Ken Andrew Talks. Basically, I'm going to give you guys updates about my channel, and I'm going to also answer some questions that you guys are probably curious about, about my channel, or for just me in general. And that's basically what the series is going to be about. I'm going to be trying to put this video out every Sunday so when you're cramming for your homework that you didn't do over the weekend or if you're not excited for the new week, you can watch this video just to waste time. But you know, whatever. So for some updates with my channel, I want to just talk about a tutorial requests because now that my channel has gone to the point where I get like 10 new people at least a day and they ask several different things, I kind of have to cater to all these different people. So if you guys don't see the tutorial right away, it's probably coming. It's probably because I'm either working on it, because it does take some practice to do things because I I honestly don't know how to do it firsthand. So I kind of just play around with the idea first and then I go off into a tutorial. I may be somewhat good at sewing, but there's still a lot of things I need to learn about sewing. I just request that you guys be uh, patient with the tutorials. So that's what's going on with the tutorial requests. The next thing I want to update you guys is the theme of next month. If you guys haven't noticed already, my tutorials are based on a certain piece of clothing, which I do every month. Like this month was sweaters and jackets. Uh, last month was like t-shirts. So next month is going to be hats. I'm going to go back to snapbacks and all that stuff. I'm going to be doing beanies. And the third thing I'm going to be doing is sweats. Those are going to be the three things I'm going to be doing next month. I'm probably going to try to push out some smaller tutorials. But I don't know how that's going to go yet. So that's basically what you guys are going to expect for next month. All that three things. So sweats, uh, hats again, and beanies. So for my q and A, I I kind of just picked out some frequently asked questions that's been asked through my um, YouTube comments, my Twitter and Instagram. So the first question is, what sewing machine do you use and why? I actually have two machines. One I use for everyday sewing and the other one for uh, customizing hats. So the machine that you guys see in all my videos is the Genome HC1000. It'll run you about 300 bucks, but it got pretty much everything you need for a beginner sewer or someone that just wants to make clothing as a hobby. It's a really good machine. It has pretty much everything, every stitch you will need. And it's very simple to use. And the other machine that I use is the Sailrite LSV-1. It'll run you about 800 bucks. This is what I do all my upholstery and customized hats with. So the next question is, if I'm a new sewer, what sewing machine should I get? Or if I'm customizing hats, what machine do you recommend me getting? So if you're new to sewing or if you want to start learning how to sew, I recommend getting just any machine because you want to just kind of want to see if you like sewing in general. You don't want to just go out and buy a machine just to make one thing. So just kind of get a cheapo machine, try it out if you like it, then, then keep taking steps on machines. So like from basic to home sewing to commercial to industrial to whatever. Just take your steps from the bottom and work your way up with sewing machines. For all you guys who want to customize snapbacks and is serious about it, like you want to make a business out of it, the machine I recommend is a Juki DD, DDL 5550, so 5550. This is the machine that a lot of customization hat people use. and. It's just a really good machine. I actually tried it out because I went to the local sewing machine store, brought my hat in, and I actually went and customized the hat at the store. It literally took me 30 minutes to do, which usually it takes me about 45 on my other machine. And actually on my uh, industrial machine, it just takes me about 30 minutes. So, But the Juki is a really good machine. It'll last you forever. Um, I know a lot of people that have a Juki and they still have one and they still use it over any other machine that they have. Um, so I really recommend getting a Juki DDL 5550. It's going to run you about $1,000. But it's a one time purchase and if you're really serious about customizing hats, that would be the machine that you would want. So the last question is, are you going to start a business, an online store, or a brand? If so, when? I've always thought of starting my own brand. I actually had a name back then which was Liberal Society. 
Which now, now looking back at it, I thought it was, I think it's pretty stupid because I it has nothing to do with really what my clothing was all about. As far as my own brand and setting up an online store, I'm probably gonna do that in the future, but not right now. Like right now, it's not the best time to do it, especially because I'm still a student in college and I'm also working a part-time job. So it's not the best time to do it, but eventually I'll get to it. But I'll I'll keep updating you guys about my brand or if I'm gonna ever start a business. But if anything, it's not gonna be anytime soon. But I might actually start a limited customization online store next summer. That's really an iffy because it depends on what's going on next summer. That's all the questions I have to answer right now. If you guys want me to answer one of your questions, put it in the comment section below. I'll be putting that in my next Ken Andrew Talks. Have a happy Sunday. Good luck on your next week. And I'll see you guys soon. This is Ken Andrew Daily and peace.